Yo, 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 what's going on, man? It's your boy Rick Taylor. Back in the episode of that Rick Taylor podcast, and you already know what today is, man. Today is Freestyle Friday, man. I'm here with a special guest, man. My boy Lil Duty, man. What's going on with you, man? Rick, what it do, big bro? Nothing much, man. Chilling, man. Um, you know what I'm saying? Uh, we did an interview a while back before. Um, but you know, this is your first time on the actual podcast itself. So welcome, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Appreciate it. Uh, for sure appreciate you for coming on to rock out with me and stuff like that man and um you know basically we just like to let the artists come up here and spit their bars you know and let the fans know more about you and um let people like you know see what you got you know let you showcase your talent and stuff like that um but before we kick it off man let the people know like what you do and like a little bit more about you uh uh for the people who don't know me i'm an artist from milwaukee north side um I say 1958, which mm-hmm. means Burlaw, 19th all the way to 58th from Burlaw. So that's where we at with it. Yes, sir. Now, um, how long you been doing the music, man? Uh, ten years plus, but I say I'm taking it serious. A month ago, yeah, a month ago, probably a month ago, I'm taking it serious. Yeah, what made you start taking it serious? Um. When you realize that um, ain't nothing coming out of what you're doing. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, shit. Besides the people who made it in the city, K Camp. So shit, I'm trying to make it. I yeah. want to make it out this shit. Yeah. And I definitely, uh, let me ask you, like, seeing somebody like K Camp, you know, is from here and it's like a universal artist now. I'm like, what kind of, like, drive does that give you like you know how did that make you feel because you know it's hard to make it out of milwaukee i know that for sure hard as a bitch so what what is it like seeing k camp you know he coming back home doing all these shows and he's going crazy he's just a universal artist and a lot of people love him yeah uh <coughs> first i feel like um k camp underrated for one mm-hmm. don't nobody really count on k camp people count chicken more than they count k camp so it's yeah. like i um I feel like I already know it's going to be a long journey with this shit. I'm going to spend a lot of paper on this shit. Everything coming out of the pocket independently. Shit, I'm just ready for it. I'm ready for whatever come with it because I'm, I'm really trying to break this generational curse, man. My son need it. Yeah, and you definitely on the right track, man. Because um, I don't be seeing you in no type of, like, you know, bad stuff or no, you know what I'm saying, in the, in the mix or no BS or nothing like that. You just do your music and try to stick to yourself and stuff like that, man. And um. Let me ask you this, man. Like, um, how often do you do, like, you know, since you said you started taking it serious, how often do you be, like, going to the studio and stuff like that? Um, I got this new thing where uh, I used to go once a week. That's how we was doing it at first. But now I got this new thing where I'm trying to go every day, like once a day, Mm -hmm. like at least an hour a day. Yeah. Like how a person do the gym. Yeah. That, that's Just stay in the booth for like an hour a day, $40, $60 here, $40, $60, $60, you know, however it go. Yeah. Just stay in the booth for an hour. Right. I like how you said that, man, because that's like consistency. And it's study like, you know, working on your craft. You know what I'm saying? For sure. Can't go wrong with that. You know what I'm saying? Now, let me ask you one more question before we get into, the, uh, you know, the freestyle and stuff like that, man. Uh, what kind of artist is you and what kind of music is it that you make? Um... I'm gonna be all honest. I was just doing slap music, but I'm putting that shit down as of now. I uh, make that official on the interview. Mm-hmm. I'm done with slap music. Twenty two life, twenty two, twenty twenty two lifestyle out right now on all platforms. Mm-hmm. But that's probably my last tape y'all gonna get on some talking about cell phones and yeah. that other shit. I don't want to talk about that shit no more. It's way more. It's way more to talk about than that shit. Mm-hmm. Hey man, hey, yeah, I know what's even going the beats. On. It not even to cut you up, but oh, even the good, beats, yeah. like shout out Melo dropping thirty. But yeah. I'm trying to reach out to other other producers on mm-hmm. the next one. Yeah, and like I said, um, you just want to switch it up. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing wrong with that, man. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Y'all make sure y'all tap into them projects that he got out. And y'all heard what 2022 he just said. 2022 lifestyle. 2022 lifestyle out right now on Apple Music, iTunes, mm-hmm. YouTube, wherever you can find music. Type in 2022 Lifestyle, L-I-L-D-O-O-T-I-E. You'll find it. Yeah. You already know. Y'all heard what he said, man. So without further ado, man, I'm going to let you do what you came to do. You know what I'm saying? You ready for this freestyle, man? 
Yeah, let me get a little drink of water. Yeah, let's do this shit, man. Yeah, man, he gonna give y'all some of them bars, man. Let y'all know like exactly what kind of artist he is, and let let y'all hear for y'all selves. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know how we do it around this time, man. Freestyle Friday, Rick Taylor Entertainment, my boy, Lil Duty, man. I ain't gonna say no more. Y'all know what it is, man. Freestyle Friday, Lil Duty. Talk to him, my brother, Rick Taylor, man. Let me catch my vibe on this shit real quick, Rick. Mm-mm-mm-mm. COVID-23, nigga. Hey. COVID-23. Have you ever felt lost in the world, nigga? But at the end of the night, you gotta feed your little girl, nigga. Baby mama bitch instead of talking about the bills. Man, I'm stressing out. Call fat up. I need a pill. Three-way calls from my cousin. Hope he get that appeal. My granny called me like you looking for a job still. But she don't know that my phone still rings. Still, still sleeping on the couch and still drinking lean still. I know my life crazy, but I'm just trying to make a way. <laughs> Fuck that, we kill like all that shit, nigga. Fuck that shit, man. Hey. That's why I'm doing 60 to my people. Trying to stuff it in my shoebox. Bitches getting battered. Tell my old bitch the kicks. Trying to catch everything. Ain't no pit stops. You pull up on the side, then your whip chop. Remember when I used to trap in old ass flip flops? Feet cold as hell, but I'm knowing that I need a knot. Thinking about them shots I got hit, then my heart stopped. Little bro slapped me in my face and told me don't die. Man, yeah. I ain't gonna fuck around all of that shit. Bro. Yeah, <laughs> hey, hey, yeah. Hey, this all straight off the head, though, man. So y'all gotta animal pills and weed, man. So we gonna, yeah. gonna keep that shit going, man. Yeah, you know. Hey, something else, man. Hey, something you else. Got, hey, y'all whatever gotta whatever pay got. for the rest of that, but we gonna get y'all yeah, something else. You got. That's the, hey, I got some right here. Whatever you got. Well, that, yeah, I got I mean, something right here. On this uh, it's getting hot right there now. There we go. Got like seven uh, racks in the booth with me right yeah. now. Let them know. Mm. Let me talk my shit real quick. Turn my headphones up a little bit. The duty. So I can hear myself. Okay, right there. Talk to him. Yeah. Okay, I like this one. I like this beat. Right, it's my shit. Got my nigga Nick on the boards. Let me talk my okay. shit real quick. Just getting high and shit. With mm -hmm. the guys. Okay. okay, I'm just bullin' in the crib, getting high My bitch think I'm cheating, but I really been too high I just tryna to tell the truth, but I still end up lying I was with another bitch, but I really ain't fucked though Damn, what these niggas on with me? I'm just trying to get a deuce, I got 150 Say 100 for a line, yeah, he taxing, I ain't tripping though I'ma get it back off the extras when I hit the road Fuck these niggas talking about Make a nigga DJ Unk, make him walk it out I ain't yeah. in the president's nigga, what's the fuss about? If a nigga get to talking stupid, we can bust it out Cause I'm just Bullin' in the crib, getting high with the guys yeah. Bullin' in the crib, getting high with the guys okay. Bullin' in the crib, getting high with the guys okay. Bullin' in the crib, getting high with the guys What you want, duty? Bullin' in the crib, getting high with the guys Hey, bullin' in the crib, getting high with the guys Hey, bullin' in the crib, getting high with the guys Hey, people be fuck with this shit though, so yeah. okay. Hold on in the crib, high Keep going, hey Nigga, just for first two. I just make a phone call and they coming through. I got all different kind of plugs. What you trying to do? What you trying yeah. to spend? You ain't got it, man. You niggas three. Seven bands on me in the booth just to feel new. I'm just trying to ball like my mama and them knew I do. Say you getting money, boy. You lying, boy. I should have knew. Put this money in your head. They treat you like you blues clues. I'm just trying to ball in the mansion with my niggas. Put all my niggas on, all six figures. I started off making pennies, now it's double digits. Yeah, you really getting money, but is you really flipping? Bullin' in the crib, getting high with the guys. Bullin' in the crib, getting high with the guys. Bullin' in the crib, getting high with the guys. Bullin' in the crib, getting high. What you want, do you? Bullin' in the crib, getting high with the guys. Bullin' in the crib, getting high with the guys. Bullin' in the crib, getting high with the guys. Bullin' in the crib, getting high with you want on duty and i got my rick and morty you shoes on you niggas man man dog hey niggas be fuck with that shit though man hey i like that hey i like that shit bro oh yeah that's all right now that's all i like that yeah he said it's all right now you know so he get y'all that off the top from the first one he had to let y'all hear that track hey yeah that that first one man don't don't take them fuck ups as that's what it is that's straight off the top man
You already know it's raw. This is how we straight do it. Straight off man. the top, raw. No, no. Yeah. Wrote down pen pad, none of that shit. Yeah. Straight off the top, how I'm feeling, man. That's what I'm going through right now. Yes, sir. Raw, gritty. Y'all know how we do it on the Rick Taylor podcast. But you like, you know, sometimes you gotta do it like that. You don't gotta let them know you mess up. We mess up. Hey, this it's, it comes with it. It's all the part of the crap. Yeah, that shit is part of, off the top of the head when you just really freestyle and the motherfucker gonna make mistakes. But that's just yeah. how I'm really feeling. What I'm really going through. What I'm really living. So yes, yeah, sir. Man, hey, I like that track, bro. What was that bullying? Bullet in the crib. Oh, it's the called, it's, that's that. Uh, that's bullet in the crib. That's out right now. That's on. Uh, you can go get that on Apple Music, hey. iTunes, YouTube, all that too. The video actually coming soon. I'm trying hey. to do that bitch next week. That's a vibe, bro. That's a vibe. Hey, y'all want some that's some vibe, bro? Hey, that's that's a vibe right there. I like that bullet in the crib. Appreciate it for the show, man. So um, that's already out. So you know what I'm saying. What what's next, man? What's what's next for Little Duty? Um. The tape already done. I'm like one song. I got. I wanted to add seven songs to it because I ain't gonna lie. I ain't dropping no music in like a year and a half. So mm-hmm. I'm like, I want to give them a full project, but I feel like I'm taking too long. But I don't want to rush it. So I really got a project in hand right now. Uh, well invested, money well spent, volume one. Mm-hmm. I got my own little label and shit going right now with money. Uh, well invested. But you could it's gonna be to y'all presented as well invested entertainment, but it's well invested right. LLC right now. But yeah, man, it's coming. It's all it's coming all from the basement right now. Right. And you know what? Like um you said I noticed something you said you you feel like you taking long, but as we spoke and stuff before, I don't really think you taking long because you know, you trying to get the business side down pat. For I, sure. I've been That's all that. I've been thinking about lately. Yeah, I, I've been really noticing that about you. Like, you've been trying to get the business down packed and trying to get your situation right and make sure you do it the right way because all it takes for that one song to pop and if your business ain't right and stuff like that, what, what good is it going to be? You know what I'm saying? So I can name a couple examples like that, but we ain't going to speak on shit. Yeah, and I noticed something to us about you, bro. Like, uh, you're a family guy, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? Whatever, do, do you have your family at the studios with you and stuff like that sometimes? Um, like, do you, your son see you doing music and stuff? I ain't got no friends, so I only hang with my baby mama and my son. Okay, there we so go. So it be like that sometimes. Yeah, and that's that's. I think that's a special thing too. Like you know, to have a you know a woman by your side that's that's like supporting you, that's pushing you. Then you got your son. He gonna see that whole journey. It definitely will pay off, bro. Like I honestly see that. That's the beauty in it, bro. Like. Yeah, yeah you, hopefully. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? When you ain't really got no no distractions and, like, you know what I'm saying, you're not letting no situation be a distraction. You, you, you working with what you got, your family around. That's really that's really who you be needing around, bro, because, like, we in the era now, like, in the time now, it's a real dark time, bro. Like, you don't really know who to trust. It ain't, you know, for friends and all that stuff, so. That's why I said that that, that freestyle was kind of out the head because if you really listen to it, right, I was talking some real shit, but. Yeah. It, it, I go through Way mm-hmm. through too much That's a whole different story But right. on the music tip I'm gonna be talking about That shit in my music that's, right. that's all Right man You definitely got some Dope music out man Y'all make sure Y'all definitely tap in man 2022 lifestyle Out right now uh-huh. Go download that uh, Bullet in the crib Out right now Go download that That's my latest single But all that other music I still got music out too I ain't, I get that credit to that too But it's old So mm-hmm. That's my old flavor My old style You know the old fool That's like leftovers Right So but this this new shit though I'm Cooking up something new for y'all I'm now I'm telling you This new shit though I ain't gonna lie It's all facts mm-hmm. All what I was going through At that moment All Fire Right The beat straight from Melo And mm-hmm. my cousin Mike Carter The mm-hmm. one oh, Shout out to Mike Carter too yeah. That's who made Bullet in the crib Yeah so if you're looking for a producer at a reasonable price, go holla at Mike Carter. If you fuck with that uh, Bullet in the Crib song, mm-hmm. holla at Mike Carter. Or Mellow Drop at 30. Shout out Mellow Drop yeah, at 32. Mellow too. Yes, sir. Now, um, before you get up out of here, man, let the people know where they can find you, man. Uh, um, you can find me right now on Instagram, The Only Duty. You spell it at T-H-E-O-N-L-Y underscore D-O-O-T-I-E. Yeah. It's not gonna come up no other way. Please don't spell it no other way, cause that's not my name. Don't even call me that shit. Right. It's duty, just duty. Yeah, sir. Y'all know what it is, man. Y'all make sure y'all tap in, man. Definitely, uh, artists y'all should be checking out. Definitely dedicated and humble for sure. Family, man. You know, grinding. You know, rolling with the family, man. Got the family in the in the, in the uh, lab oh, yeah, right here with him. Son, with you know, he he got back there with the ad libs. You know what I'm saying? Hey, y'all, make sure y'all tap in, man. Definitely a dope artist. Make sure y'all tap into the music and also, um, 
you know, check them out. And um, for anybody who want to come up there and rap, just DM me and stuff like that. Let me know. Artists or anybody got a business or something want to promote, just let me know. Also, hit the DM. Y'all already know how we do, man. Rick Taylor Entertainment, Lil Duty, man. We out. Shout out Rick Taylor. Like that. We out this bitch, man. Yes, sir.